Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Radium, and today I have another Terraria Calamity Mod Death Mode Armageddon video for all of you. I'm kind of cancelling the idea of a playthrough because quite frankly, the videos are taking so long to record. The boss I'm on in terms of progression right now is Yorin, and I've been on this fight for about two weeks. With no avail. And just before I show you the successful attempt, there's something incredibly cool I want to show you guys, which you can see already. Someone has made me a vanity set. I'll be shouting them out, it's absolutely incredible looking. Just, it really looks good and I appreciate it so much. The designer of this vanity set is Andre Ghost. They are an incredible graphics and sprite designer for various mods. And I'll be giving them and their Discord a shout out in the description of this video. So if you enjoy um, artistic design and this kind of stuff, and if you're really intrigued in how the Terraria sprites are made, then feel free to join that Discord. I'm sure there'll be something there for you. With that said, it's time to get into the incredibly fun death montage, because, quite frankly, I've already spent possibly 900 attempts on this fight, across various users. Uh, on this account here, I've got 366 deaths, I've been trying on different accounts, different classes, and no luck whatsoever. But I'm feeling pretty confident that I can beat this boss now, so I'm very excited to give it a go. Just for those who haven't been able to uh, um, hit me on the streams, this is the arena I'm going with. It's relatively simplistic, it's a giant rectangle with a bunch of space to dodge, and it pretty much goes out towards the edges, so it's an amazing arena. In terms of my buffs, I'm not using anything outside of Calamity apart from the Nebula Potion, which is just really to increase like damage output slightly, and last but not least, is the Unlimited Mana from Lawai AFK, which is really just to save me money as I can't be affording the Supreme Mana Potions every second. And in terms of the weapons, I'm using the Event Horizon and the Yarn's Kindle Staff, which are both really good. This thing is my choice of weapons, and although people are disagreeing with me a lot, saying the Voltaic Climax is significantly better, this is what I'm going to be going with. So I hope you guys enjoy this variable death compilation, and I will see you guys back afterwards.
Oh my god! Oh my god! I did it! 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 Oh my god! I did it! No hit yarn! Oh my god! I I genuinely did it! Oh, I don't even care! I died at the end! Oh my god! Oh my god! Fifteen hundred attempts! Oh my god! I can't breathe! Oh my god! That literally took about 30 hours of recording. Oh my god. No, well, um, that, that was fun. You guys don't understand, that fight was so easy. I'll, I'll explain to you guys what I did. I wrote out the pattern, and that final phase, on the second phase, I kept doing it. And I wrote down the pattern, there's only three attacks in the final phase. So... And they're very, very easy to dodge, so we, we did it, literally about five tries after I posted that. The best thing is we have 265 yarn treasure bags, so that's pretty much infinite money. And now I can start preparing for um, Scream Calamitous. Oh my god, I'm sorry if you guys don't like my methods. I know that was pretty much absolutely pushing the limit in terms of what is valid or not, but I do not care, we did it. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm so nervous just checking I'm recording and everything. I don't care how this looks. Oh my god, that was so difficult. But now we've defeated him, we've got our urine soul fragments and everything. We can start looking into mining auric ore, which is incredibly useful. Uh, here it is now. It's not that difficult to mine, we can just vein miner it. And obviously this is going to be used for crafting auric tesla materials. So it'll be very nice for us to just obliterate all of this, farm this out for a while, and just relax for once, because I kid you not, I'd been doing that fight for about two hours, and it was just absolute insanity. Okay, I've just got just over a thousand oracle now, and whilst I'm just sorting myself out, and chilling at my base for the first time in a long time, uh, I just want to clear up a couple of things, because I've received so many questions asking whether I have what it takes to do Supreme Calamitous. In all honesty, that's not a question I can really answer right now. I'm not in a good mindset, but at the same time after that, I'm actually feeling quite confident. Uh, I know that confidence will be just shredded the second I start trying it, but overall, I'm just so happy right now I don't have to do that fight again, at least for a while. And the good thing about... Um, the Alchemist NPC mod is I can buy the urine soul fragments for an extreme price, but I can buy them, so I don't need to do the fight again to get more Tesla bars. With that said, I think I am going to leave this video here. I'm so sorry it's so short, but this project has literally taken me weeks to get out. I was trying this before the Calamity Temp ban, before everything, and I've only just done it, and I'm so happy it's over. But at the same time, the Supreme Calamitous grind is only going to be 10 times worse. So with that said, thank you all so much for watching. If you did enjoy, then feel free to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And as always, I will see all of you in the next one. Peace out, guys.